News at 2. I'm Justine Waldman. We start with that breaking news, which comes to us from the North Bay, where four Sonoma schools are on lockdown because of a credible threat. We have new video now into our newsroom. This is from outside of Sonoma Valley and Creekside High School. It's showing us the situation. The sheriff's office says these two schools were threatened and have been on lockdown since around noon. Here we have parents and students standing outside. The schools do share a campus along Broadway, just south of MacArthur Street. Adele Harrison Middle School and Prestwood Elementary School are also on lockdown because of how close they are to that high school campus, but they are not considered to be under a threat right now. That's according to the sheriff's office. Crowd for Sleep Jagal outside the schools now. He joins us on the phone. Philippe, what's the very latest here? Are these schools still on lockdown? And have they elaborated at all as to what this threat might be? No word from authorities on what the threat may be, but the schools are still on lockdown. I'm out front of Sonoma Valley High School and Creekside High, and traffic is moving slowly on Broadway. A lot of family members waiting outside of the school across the street. The sheriff's office has the entire area blocked off. I have seen video of a person being detained on campus that appears to be a student we don't know why exactly, but uh, those who have shared this video with me say it's because this student ran away from the rest of his classmates, and that triggered a response from the sheriff's department, but we don't know if they're implicated in what's going on here. So that video is going around, but I want to caution everybody about why that person was detained. Uh, the sheriff's office doesn't seem to be moving at this point. Um, I did film some video of students peering out of their classroom windows. Uh, the situation is not tense, but there is a lot of anxiety out here. Um, and there are rumors spreading around. And again, I want to make sure that we don't jump to conclusions. This is what parents and uh, siblings of those on campus right now locked down tell me it has been the third threat uh, this early school year. So, um, I'm told this has triggered a larger response than normal, but um, I have heard no action on campus, and uh, there hasn't been a surge of officers on campus, but they are certainly surrounding the place. Philippe Chagall is live for us there in Sonoma. He'll continue to get the latest details for us on this ongoing situation. Our newsroom is working to get more details as well, and we'll share them with you as soon as we get them right here on Cron4 and our website, cron4.com. Philippe, thank you.